Hello, my name is Suraj Hawk, and I'm a fourth year medical student from the University of Dundee. I'm speaking on behalf of Professor Meinl Hawk and his team for the study entitled Professionalism Perspectives Among Medical Students of a Novel Medical Graduate School in Malaysia. Defining professionalism in this constantly evolving world is not easy. How do you measure degrees of benevolence and compassion? If it is so obvious to a profession what professionalism is, then why is it so difficult to teach to medical students and residents? Today's definition of medical professionalism is evolving, from autonomy to accountability, from expert opinion to evidence-based medicine, from self-interest to teamwork and shared responsibility. The purpose of this study is to explore professionalism in terms of its fundamental elements among medical students from the University of Sultan Zainal Abidin, or UNISA, in Malaysia. This was a cross-sectional study carried out on medical students of an UNISA. The study population included preclinical and clinical UNISA medical students from year 1 to 5 of academic session 2014 to 2015. A simple random sampling technique was used to select the cohort. Data was collected using a validated instrument, a questionnaire which was adapted for use with UNISA medical students. The questionnaire explored nine core elements of professionalism, including honesty and accountability, amongst others. Out of 165 questionnaires distributed randomly among year 1 to 5 medical students of UNISA, 144 were returned, giving a response rate of 87%. Among the study participants, 38% and 62% were male and female respectively. Out of a maximum possible score of 220, the mean questionnaire score across the cohort was 170.92. The average score for male students was 166.98 and 173.49 for female students, which was not statistically significantly different. The current study found almost similar levels of familiarity with all fundamental issues of professionalism, with no statistically significant differences with a p-value of 0.05. It is suggested that medical faculty members should provide more guidance to medical students for their professional development. Henceforth, researchers believe and expect the country will produce more rational and holistic medical students. Thank you for listening.